What if I told you that in Finding Nemo, Nemo actually didn't survive the attack that killed his mom and siblings? And the movie is actually just an allegory of Marlene dealing with grief. First off, Nemo in Latin means nothing, hinting at Nemo being nothing than a figment of imagination for Marlin. Secondly, the five stages of grief are actually shown throughout this film. Denial, which is when Marlin doesn't want Nemo to go to school. Anger, which is when Marlin yells at Nemo for swimming out too far in the ocean. Bargaining, which is when Marlin's traveling across the ocean. Despair, which is when he sees Nemo flush down the drain. And then finally, acceptance, which is when he finally lets go of the past. But what are your guys' thoughts? 